Alexander Volkanovsky used to be a semi-professional rugby player before he transitioned to combat sports. It's only natural if you find it difficult to imagine Volkanovsky as a rugby player considering his height. However, he was an absolute beast on the field and weighed 214 pounds back in the day. Volkanovsky played as a front row, a position usually occupied by big and intimidating men. Despite the size advantage, Volkanovsky would go toe to toe with significantly larger men in the opposition team. They used to underestimate Volkanovsky's abilities and he would just run through everyone. Volkanovsky played for his local team, Warilla Gorillas. He was one of the most important members of the team and even won the league's best player award in 2010. Volkanovsky also helped Warilla Gorillas capture the South Coast Rugby League in 2011 and was awarded the man of the match in the finals. At that time, Volkanovsky was 23 years of age. He always had an itch to try his hand at combat sports and that's when he decided to switch to mixed martial arts. Volkanovsky already had a wrestling background which made it easier for him to transition to MMA. On his first sparring day, Volkanovsky submitted his sparring partner twice on quick occasions. That's when his coach realised that Volkanovsky is a special talent. The Australian fighter wasted no time in making his pro debut and he just kept on improving his game since then.